Does this sound like your company? You employ a mobile workforce and they travel frequently. They travel locally, interstate and overseas and need a range of different travel services including commercial flights and charters, hotels and rental cars and site-based accommodation villages. How is corporate travel managed today? Well, it's a six-step process. It starts when someone fills out a request for travel form, listing name, position and contact details, plus the travel services and dates of travel. The form also carries special information such as food allergies and the company's cost code dissections. The request is passed to the travel desk where it's priced and checked to ensure it conforms with the company's travel policies. And from there, it goes to management who need to authorise the travel and approve the cost. Once the travel desk has received formal approval, the itinerary is divided up with the travel agent handling commercial sectors, the service providers managing charters and camps, and any local business that might be providing travel-related services, such as buses and motel accommodation. Once we have confirmation from all the various service providers, then cost estimates can be finalised and the complete booking can be confirmed back to the traveller. From here, the travel desk will continue to monitor the booking's progress for any service amendments, cancellations or price changes, and for any special offers that might come along. Eventually, the commercial travel sectors are ticketed, the itinerary is finalised, and the person is ready to travel. So, what are the problems with this approach? Well, number one, it's labour intensive. A booking with three services, a commercial flight, a charter leg and a camp stay involves three companies, five people and 12 touch points. Problem number two is the booking is being entered over and over again. This leads to delays at each step and the potential for errors on each occasion. And many hands equals many errors. And finally, there is little to no time spent ensuring the itinerary is the right one for the traveller and the most cost effective for the company, because time is mainly spent just getting the travel booked. In other words, time on processing means no time for quality assurance or review. So, what's the answer? Well, we could use a system that will allow the user to enter and confirm their travel request form online, then notifies the travel desk that the request is waiting. The travel desk reviews and confirms the travel after applying changes that improves the travel experience while staying within company policy. At this point, the system confirms availability and cost with each service provider involved, then presents the itinerary electronically to management for final acceptance of the trip and its cost. From here, and with no further human intervention, the system places commercial bookings directly with the contracted airline, hotel or rental car company, using the same global booking systems that your travel agent employs today. The system also applies company policy to ensure your preferred carriers, routes and rates are enforced. The same automation is used by camp and charter providers to confirm and allocate a room or seat. Once the booking itinerary has been fulfilled, the system distributes a booking confirmation, complete with booking references, seat and room details, and company commentary added in support of the service provider and company's policies and guidelines for travel. The booking and its individual segments can be checked at any time for improvements in price or trip time, right up to the time of travel. Sound too good to be true? Well, that system is here today, and it's called Corporate Travel Desk from VAMS Next Gen.